So why was wow. you dissing your homie? <laughs> this is my homie. Who you talking about? Uh, Yellow Hill. Call me Messi. I'm just trying to figure out, like, cause you know what I mean. If you trying to stop doing that, you talking about? Nah, for sure. No, you trying to talking about niggas just going Hollywood and all that. You you big sad 1900. Yeah. Why would you go over here and reach over here and dish your fucking homie? Why would you do that, cuz? I'm I'm just I'm I'm burnt. Like me. That was an epic. epic I'm a epic, burnt by the nigga. Way. Yeah. Like me, I I'm just the type of nigga, bro. Like say if I was in jail, bro. You know, a lot of niggas be they be. Whispering behind, I'm typing. I'm gonna go straight to the nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm gonna just speak my mind. Like yeah. it might be reckless how it come across sometimes. But I was saying, I was explaining that to you our last interview. Like I might say shit at the moment. It might come across reckless. It's sometimes about it's how I say it too. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? But I just feel like, bro, I'm being myself. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I ain't. I, I work too hard to be humble. To like, I, man, I got 16 albums, man, in four years. And Talk niggas about don't it. niggas don't even be talking about that. Talk about it. You know what I'm saying? So I be, I'm like, man, I ain't being humble with these niggas. Man, I'm stepping. Niggas don't got 16 albums their whole career, and these niggas been rapping 10 years. You gotta be like that. But you, know you be like that. They but you, gonna you, gotta, but you got though, a right? good core. You got a good core yeah. coming from your section. You feel me? Grab working, everybody man. up, doing it up. You feel yeah. me? And you know what I'm saying? Let's go crazy. Let's go. You know what I'm saying? Let's take this shit to the to the next to level. The next level. I don't nah, want, yeah, sure. I don't want I don't want you to do that. You know what was bold? You know what was bold? <laughs> I, was, I, I wanted to tell you about that. What was bold when um, Baby Stone Gorillas came out? Yeah. And at the time they was dissing Crips. Yeah. And everybody was like, they don't fuck with Crips. They don't fuck with Crips. And, and you, I went and did you, a song with you them. You went and did a song with them, and Put that up fucked hood, everybody video, up. Fucked everybody up. You know and what then I mean? you see all the other Crips start wanting to do songs with them after that. I'm yeah. just type of nigga, bro. I don't, I don't move off of, i never been a follower. i always been a leader. So I move off of like how I be feeling. When I seen them little niggas, I'm like, man, it's L.A. Yeah. You get me? Because everybody else I was hearing, they was like rapping on Detroit beats and doing other shit. So when I heard them little niggas, it was like something new I ain't heard before. I mean, you know what I'm saying? They was dissing and doing what they was doing. But that's their lingo. That's their lingo. That's their lingo. If you from Hoover, you talk a certain way. If you from Insane, yeah, Blackstones, right. you a Crip of Blood, you talk a certain way. If you from out here, you know that. You know what I'm saying? It'd be times we'd be in the county jail. A nigga might say something in the county jail. You might, a nigga might, might have to be like, bro, whoa, whoa. I've been around like neighborhood niggas in the county jail. They say that three word. And the nigga had to correct the nigga. Like, yeah. hey, bro, I'm from West LA Trades. Woo woo. No, all right, yeah, woo woo. It's respectful. Unless the nigga get extra. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes it be like that. Just, But that's just how they talk, though. You feel me? Being from neighborhood. Right, right. You feel me? So it just be like that out here for sure. Yeah, I understood you got, it. You got to understand that shit and respect it, man. Because a lot of niggas get, uh, you know, offended by it. Yeah. But I like that you stepped well, out and was like, nigga. Niggas, man. Yeah, you stepped out and did it. Niggas. And I remember watching that shit. I was like, ooh, that's bold. I'm fuck with him. We got a tape coming out, too. Yeah. We trying to drop on Halloween. And now they moving. Show sure, going crazy. And now everybody Those niggas trying to stand away from the little niggas. Now they want to stand by them niggas. Yeah. I just, you know, I move off of how I move. I'm, I'm, just, I'm that type of nigga, bro. Like how everybody was trying to stand away from Tory Lanez. I'm the type of nigga. I'm going to still see some good in the nigga, man. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. I interviewed them little niggas too, man. They was tight. You know what I mean? Like, and I, you know, sure. I kind of got some backlash, you know what I'm saying, for, you know, repeating what they be saying and doing it all up. But I, I just repeated what they saying because, you know, I was shocked when I heard this shit too. I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Everybody <laughs> you were banging on wax. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like, like banging right. on wax. I played that shit too. Nigga, be brazy. Everybody it's played hard. that shit. That's what I'm not even going to lie. If you didn't play be brazy, man. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck you was doing, nigga. Yeah. You a damn lie. The relatives. He hard. That shit was hard. So, relatives. That shit was hard. Nationwide, Red Riders. We was playing yeah. all that shit. We was playing that shit, though. You know what I mean? But yeah, I interviewed them niggas. You feel me? Uh, you know, LA just got. I think it's just a lot of politics that we just gotta let go, man. For sure, just let it Definitely. go. Just let it go, dude. Shout it's, out Zoe Summer. Really, I got really, a song with Zoe Summer. He a neighborhood. Listen, yeah. I remember when Zoe. You know what I'm saying? When going Zoe, crazy right now. Cause shout out to my nigga Zoe. I was trying to sign him at the time, and he had told me about the shit. Cause that was like a year ago. Yeah, that's, yeah, we've been having that for a minute. Yeah, we gonna do like, some more shit. Too. He like, nigga, I got a song. I got a song with this nigga. He's like, if I drop this shit, it's gonna go crazy. Crazy. And I'm like, damn, that's dope that you worked with him. Yeah. Like you bold, you 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 step out there and work with niggas like that you should. But still know, though, you know, where he at? Bro, at the end of you know what I'm saying? Bold. You know what I'm saying? But still, where he at? You still might have some niggas that's ignorant and not not. You know what I'm saying? Having grew mentally. And for sure. when he put that out, he has to be prepared for, for sure. that. Me too. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. Me too, for sure. Yeah. And you got to be prepared for niggas mounting up other niggas that's going to convince these niggas that you did wrong. For sure. You know what I mean? Because niggas ain't there mentally. Cause you feel me? So, mm -hmm. but and I will you say gone. This. You know what I mean? Zo, Zo mentally is, is there too. Like, for sure. You know, he oh, time you that's what made me fuck with him. I'm not, I like this nigga, man. I like the way he carries That nigga's a smart nigga. Yeah, right. Something, man. I'm not His like this nigga. energy is good. I'm like, yeah. man, fuck that yeah. gangbang and shit, man. I yeah. like this nigga. You know what I'm saying? Plus, I know his people, like, we, a lot of
gang banging, bro, we let like we let this shit get in the way of our lives, bro. We only got one life. You know what right. I'm saying? Me, I'm just gonna be that one nigga, bro. I'm gonna always go against the grain, bro. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna like, you know what I'm saying? That should have fucked you up talking in Talking about it bad, but but if I if I gotta go out my way and work with somebody, like, I want to do a song with Pac Man, bro. I'm I'm not. You feel what I'm saying? I right. like. I think Pac Man is dope. Right. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, it's like I'm just that type of nigga, bro. Like I'm gonna work with whoever I, I want to work with. That's Shout so. out Pac Man too. You yeah. know what I mean? And when you a solid nigga like that, your homies I, you know don't know. Your homies yeah, don't like that's sad, nigga. That's how you is. That's how you is. They don't respect bro. it. You know sure. what I mean? Like sad gonna do what sad do. My homies yeah. do know that. That's a fact. Yeah. yeah. What they say behind closed doors, as long as they don't say it to me. I ain't tripping. You feel me? Facts, I, I DM Pac Man too. He, he hit me back. <laughs> I think I, I think I DM I think I DM I DM them too and he hit me back. Like, it's all niggas good. Don't, I started learning though. Niggas don't always see they DMs, bro. Sometimes they DM, don't, bro. I I don't even got that many followers, nigga. I got thirteen thousand followers, nigga. I can I don't even see every DM, bro. I get so I mean lately, especially these last nigga thirty days, I've been getting nigga. I delete all my messages and like nigga forty more pop back up. It's crazy right now. I, I can't. Man, I'm not gonna catch the uh, right. DM for sure. I ain't gonna catch the message. But if y'all see him, man, y'all holler at him, man. Tell him what's the deal, man. Come on back on Fig, man. Or come over here to Fig yeah, Community where I want to fuck man, with you, man. man. Man, shout out to you, man. Don't worry about nothing, man. Since we talking about uh, music right now, you feel me? Uh, Fabio Foreign reveals how much his catalog is worth. He said eight figures. 